One, two, three. One, two, three. Rune boots. Yeah. 400k. Yes. Cash money. Thank you. Holy rune boots. Rune boots. Now I'll probably end up selling these rune boots, even though they look kind of pretty. I miss rune boots being the, the, the best boots. And plus, the old look of boots look awesome. But yeah, I told you guys, next task, the next video I start, I will be at Necrills, and I am, and thank god, and this is awesome. Anyways, one thing I hate about the Slayer task is the fact that these weird things do hit through your melee prayer, like, very, every so often, they hit, like, a 2 or some crap, um, which really pisses me off, because I have to bring food, and I don't know if I even brought enough food this time. I remember they, these little things hit through prayer in EOC, but I didn't know if that was just because it was a glitch or not, but I guess it's been true, they always hit through melee prayer, so this is a task I guess you'd probably want to use Guthans on. Anyways, if you haven't noticed, I have recently got 60 prayer. Um, I'm just waiting now to take my 84 attack, and I should be 100 combat once I get this, and then 17k off. Will be hopefully 100 uh, combat once I get it, and then I can go do my two quests, um, Shadow Village and uh, I think the Jungle Potion first. And then hopefully then, I will once I'm 100 combat, yeah, just hit a 2 on me. Stop hitting 2s. But yeah, then hopefully I can use the new Slayer Master. Now, I am slowly working on trying to obtain full Guthans um, because of all the mall drops I've received. Um, I'm actually quite close to being able to afford it. Since I got like three mall drops in like one night, which is like three mil plus, I think I ended up selling them for. Um, I sold the last one for about 950k, like just recently, because uh, I think they crashed a little bit. But yeah, I bought the full helm for I think uh, 800k or 750, no 800k. Um, I bought the plate for 750, and I bought the chain skirt for 600k. Um, and I have a very little left besides just the GMO I've sold. And I'm working on the spear. I think the spear is 1.9 mil apparently. So um, another G mall drop if I can get it, then I basically have full Guthans. Which is very surprising. I didn't expect to get that anytime soon. The reason I'm getting Guthans, guys, is because I think that it will help me a lot with having to spend money on prayer pots. I mean, prayer pots are reaching 5k each recently, and that's just too much for me to honestly keep up with. I mean, that's literally taking away so much of my money. Like, think about it, 200 peat pots is like one G mall drop. Like, only 200 pots. That's crazy. I go through 200 peat pots in like a day and a half or some crap, so that's really shit. So I figured Guthans might actually be an investment in a way, because uh, I won't need prayer pots as much anymore, and uh, I can, you know, heal myself and all that crap, so yeah. Well, it looks like I just got someone to buy my boots for about 400k, which I think is actually going to help me get close to the uh, spear, so I'm going to sell them for sure. I, I'll stick with Addy boots for now, I guess, I don't know. These things drop a lot of blood, or uh, death runes, that's, that's like 16k right there. Cash money. This turned out to be a successful trip. 84 attack. Do I check if I'm 100 combat? Oh. Oh. Jeez. Three digit combat level. Oh my god. Yeah, he's a combat calculator to check. I mean, this is like the quickest possible setup I could get to get 100 combat. Um, I can train strength now. Fuck ever training attack with a freaking D skimmy ever again. You gotta check out any more I've left. I still have a guy waiting to buy my room boots, and I don't want him to like have to go off or some shit, because thick as offer is okay. Oh, look who's talking to me now. I didn't get my task from you, you dummy. <laughs> oh god, how many more do I have left? Come on, please. So, I just finished doing the uh, the quest, as you guys can see in the background, for Shadow Village. Um, now I can basically start using the next Slayer Master, and which means, uh, if you guys want to know a quick way to get there, I'm sure I'll show you guys later on in the video, but... Um, just to quickly add, uh, basically, you're, you're going to want to get 45 magic teleport to Kami. That's basically what I did. I just quickly attacked some, like, knights and shit or whatever. Got my magic to 45. Um, I actually did some, like, super heat after. Super heat iron ore. It's, it's a big waste of money, but it's quick levels. Um, so, anyways, teleport to Kami. Run south of the uh, Kami bank, south of it. Take the boats to Brimhaven. And right where the fruit patch tree is, or the, uh, the like, where I normally plant my palm trees, um, there's a little cart there that you pay 200 GP. Uh, you go on that cart and it brings you straight to Shadow Village, uh, right beside the bank. Um, I remember doing this way back in the day, but I completely forgot about it until I had, uh, recently looked it up. Um, but yeah, anyways, just to add that in the video. Uh, anyways, hope you guys enjoy and continue watching. Oh my goodness, another pair of rune boots. Anyways, yeah, I'm going to sell this pair. I think I already got someone. I just checked the forums quickly. I think I got a guy buying it for 450k, which is great. I honestly don't even know what the price of these things are. I mean, I guess it's kind of the nice things of this game is that nobody really knows a set price of something. I mean, I guess in reality, it's whatever you want to pay for is what you pay for it. And whatever you want to sell it for is what you want to sell it for. But, um, yeah, so hopefully once I sell these, I might actually almost now be able to buy myself a Guthan Spear. Uh, I think they're about 1.8 to 1.9 mil. A lot of people are selling them for 2 mil, but I mean, like, you yeah. know. Like, I don't get it. Whenever I see people selling the same item for the same price as each other, like, I don't get how, like, not one of them 
will offer a little bit less. Like I, I don't get it. It's like, okay, well, you're like one of 30 selling for the same price. You're not going to move your price down a little bit so you can sell it instantly or like, I, I don't understand. I had like four people PM me two mil each. I'm just like, well, you're the fourth person. They're like, oh, I'm not moving my price. I'm just like, oh, okay, well, wait till it crashes the next day and then you'll be selling it for less anyways. But yeah, I'm actually very, very surprised. I'm already buying myself full Guthans. I mean, I've done nothing but straight Slayer uh, by myself basically for uh, the whole time. And I'm able to buy myself full Guthans almost already. I'm thinking hopefully by the time I get 85 Slayer, I might be able to buy myself DH as well for the Killing Abyssal Demons. But I would like to buy myself 70 Prayer before I do anything else besides buying the Guthans. Uh, just for the Piety Prayer and then I gotta do stupid like three more quests and like one small favorite quest. That's gonna be a bitch. Um, and then I can use Piety while I'm killing Abyssal Demons. I'm probably just gonna kill them with, uh, I'm thinking of D-Skimmy. I mean, I'm gonna probably test out DH versus D-Skimmy for a little while just to see which one is actually better. Um, because I honestly hate slow weapons and DH is slow as shit and when you hit the zero with it, it's just like wow. And yeah, I'm gonna test it out and we'll see which one's better. Um, most people do use DHO for it, but you know, we'll see. I kind of wish climbing boots, no offense to the peak gears, were, uh, not only valued more, but at least, um, not two strength bonus like rune boots are. They should be one strength bonus, because rune boots, I mean, you need 80 Slayer to get them. They should be the best. I mean, like, there's, you can do a quest in, t in five or ten minutes and get the same strength bonus from those boots as you do from rune boots. It doesn't really make much sense. Um, and, you know, that's one of those things that just kind of suck. I mean, I, I think it should be one strength bonus. Same with Adamant, you know, I think they are one strength bonus. I mean, they should be the same as Addy, because, you know, I mean, that's kind of a little bit easier. But it's always been two strength bonus, so obviously they're not going to change that. But I just think it's kind of odd. Maybe Rune Boots should be three strength bonus or some crap, I guess. But yeah, hopefully with Guthans, I can actually do this Slayer task in one inventory instead of having to like, run out of food and shit. I hate how these little things hit high on you. Like, they hit like twos and threes. Anyways, I'm currently watching the movie uh, Jack Reach, I think it's called. I think it's one of the newer movies that's out. Uh, yeah, 2012. So it's out. It's recently. Um, it's a pretty good movie so far. I only just started. I'm only 20 minutes in, but you know, whatever. Oh yeah, Runefulham. I still feel really st retarded having this cape, and I, I don't like. There's no point of even wearing this cape. It's just kind of something to wear. Like I don't know. I'll probably be attempting a fire cape sometime soon. I, I just want to make sure I have. I mean, Guthans will really help me in there, just in case, um, so I can heal off like those little uh, level 90 ranger things, stuff like that. So that's really gonna help a lot for those caves. Um, and I mean, I'm, I'm pretty sure with this, just that, I'll be good to do the whole waves. But I might as well get 70 prayer before I actually try, just to have that extra little bit of bonus. So I don't have to worry about prayer bots too much.